Hey y'all, Mark from the Peaceful Valley Donkey Rescue. I just want to take a few minutes and tell you a little bit about what we do and who we are. Amy, my wife and I, founded Peaceful Valley 20 years ago out in Southern California. And at the time we thought we were just going to be a small community-based donkey rescue. But over that 20 year period, we have grown into the largest equine rescue in the United States. We have our headquarters here in San Angelo, Texas. We're on 172 acres. We grow some of our own hay and we have plenty of pasture for the donkeys to graze. We also have a ranch in Lynchburg, Virginia and another one uh, in scenic Arizona. Those all have trucks, trailers, tractors, employees, the whole nine yards. So from any one of our ranches, we can be anywhere in the United States within 24 hours. We have 20 sanctuaries that account for hundreds of thousands of acres. Um, those are for the donkeys that just aren't ready to go into the adoption pipeline yet. And we have 36 satellite adoption centers. And those are folks that take our donkeys into their homes and adopt them locally for us. That way we can move the donkeys to areas where they're not as common and there's a little bit more need for them. Our adoption program is probably our most important of all the programs that we have. With, without adoption, we don't have room to bring in more donkeys. And so the satellite adoption program has just been instrumental in moving in huge numbers of donkeys in, into loving homes. To be adoptable, our donkeys have to be friendly. They have to accept a halter, walk on lead, pick up all four uh, hosts for trimming. Over the years, we've adopted hundreds and hundreds of donkeys into really good, loving homes. In our adoption program, the donkeys have to come back to us if uh, they, the adopters can no longer take care of them. Everybody's life changes. They might get a job transfer. They might have to move to town. So the donkeys just come back to us and then we can place them in a new home. Peaceful Valley manages millions of acres of wild burrow habitat. Uh, we work for the National Park Service, U.S. Fish and Wildlife, U.S. military, NASA, as well as a lot of state agencies along the border. Uh, the burrows are all captured humanely. We use self-catching traps. Uh, we castrate all the males and they begin training just as soon as they can. Some of them aren't ready, so those are the ones that will go out on sanctuary for a while. Peace Valley works throughout the Caribbean. Uh, just about anywhere where there was colonialism, there are donkeys. They were the main tool of colonialism. They came to the Caribbean on Columbus's second voyage in 1493, and they quickly spread throughout all the islands. They were used in mining, agriculture, and transportation. Uh, a few years ago, we actually flew 120 donkeys from Kona, Hawaii to Los Angeles International Airport, because they, again, they were brought there to work in the sugar cane and the uh, coffee plantations. And then at the end of World War II, there was so much equipment that was left over that it was just cheaper to buy a truck or a tractor or a jeep than it was to keep your donkey employed. So they just released them. And donkeys are hardy. They thrived and they thrived. And they, a, a, a herd of donkeys will double in population every four years. So you can see that there, there, there's an issue out there that they have to be addressed. We just can't let them overpopulate. Peaceful Valley works with many veterinary schools across the country, uh, most notably uh, Texas A&M. Uh, UC Davis out in Davis, California, and Cornell in New York. And we've got the best and brightest minds doing some really great research on donkeys. Uh, nobody's ever done it. And we're, we're doing some cutting edge stuff to improve the care and lives of donkeys throughout the whole world. Animal rescue is really expensive. We spend millions of dollars on the care of the donkeys. At any given time, we have about 3,000 donkeys in our direct care. They're constantly coming in and hopefully they're going out through adoption, but it's costly. Just here in Texas, we feed 12,000 pounds of hay every single day. And that doesn't include the supplemental feeds to the moms that are nursing, to the pregnant gens, and the ones that come in skinny. So it's, it's expensive. Uh, fundraising is, is, is critical to what we do. Without the money, we cannot provide the proper care to the donkeys already here. And we can't go out and perform these large rescues that we're called to do. We worked with uh, Inyo County Sheriff Department in California to do a hoarding seizure. And that was 144 donkeys, nine horses, and seven mules. It, we spent well over $100,000 just on that one rescue. 
And so without having the funds on hand, we wouldn't be able to have gotten those animals out of those terrible conditions. To learn more about Peace of Valley Donkey Rescue, you can go to our website, donkeyrescue.org. Uh, you can look for us on social media and you can uh, reach out to the main office uh, at 866-366-5731 and y'all be good. We'll talk soon.